Lions, welcome back to episode 24 of the Eastside Extra. Dude, so you know that meme contest we're hosting? Yeah, what about it? Well, I've been messing around with Photoshop lately. Look at some of the stuff that I made. Wow, dude, that's really funny. I don't know if anyone else is gonna be able to top that in the contest. I know, right? It's gonna be hard to beat. Well, stick around to the end of today's episode to see what memes everyone came up with. For now, let's get right into this week's episode. Hey Lions, this is Student Life back with more news relevant to you. Tutoring has resumed and is in full swing. It is in the library on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays from 3 to 4 p.m. All subjects are supported, so come get caught up and get whatever help you may need. The Eastside core values are an important aspect here at Eastside. Respect, overcome, aspire, and rise. We took to the streets to take a closer look at your definition of respect. Roll the clip. My definition of respect is pretty much when like you understand the person's perspective, and I feel like you can't, you don't get respect, you earn it. It's uh, treating other people the way you want to be treated and knowing that they're capable of doing things um, and believing in the best of them. My definition of respect is basically uh, don't say anything offensive, respect my personal bubble, you know. So my definition of respect is to show gratitude towards others and affirm other people's opinions. In case you didn't know, this week is Spirit Week for Black History Month. Yesterday was dressed like a 90s movie or TV show and today is Blackout Day. For more information on themes and more about black history, visit Eastside's Black Student Union Instagram at eastside.bsu. Make sure you give them a follow too. That's all for this week. See you next week, Lions. Good morning, Lions. Welcome back to the activity side of the Eastside Extra, back with more news relevant to you. Students, are you interested in becoming a firefighter? Become a fire explorer. Becoming a fire explorer provides participants with basic safety training, first aid skills, and CPR certification, and valuable hands-on experience. It allows participants to see if the fire department is a career that they would be interested in pursuing. Fire explorers participate in two meetings per month on Wednesday evenings at Fire Station 129. If you are interested, go to the link down below. Kobe. Mr. Cowan's Sound Engineering II classes recently completed a project in honor of the late great Kobe Bryant. The students are studying film score and composition and were tasked with creating an original piece of music to a three minute video of Kobe Bryant highlights. The top student projects were judged by professional music producers and musicians. Now we want our Eastside students to judge the two top projects. Tell us which one you think has the best musical arrangement. In the 1996 NBA Draft, the Charlotte Hornets select Kobe Bryant from Lower Marion High School in Pennsylvania. Also, if you are interested in learning more about music production and audio engineering, sign up for Sound Engineering as an elective class for next year, or reach out to Mr. Cowan directly in Lab 223. We had a great time at the talent show last week. Here are some highlights. What did we learn? That cat can't swim. <clears throat> Not to give cat directions, okay? No. <laughs> Dog. Teamwork is key, bro. Hands in. Uzma Kappa, Uzma. That's from Monsters, Inc. All right. Kiki Waka, Kiki Waka.
That's it for the activity side of the East Side Extra. Bye. Hey Lions, welcome back to the academy side of the East Side Extra. Let's catch up on what the academies are doing. The juniors did a project on specific types of cancer and had to present them to other students. In their chemistry class, they conducted an experiment on carbon dioxide and combustion reactions. So let's see if this works. What color do we think it's gonna turn? Green. They got to do something fun as a result and dissected pigs. How fun. So here we cut off the majority of the connective tissue within the small intestine so that we can uh, get an overall measure of it as well as the weight and uh, pictures from it. So that we can all organize it into a presentation. Seniors are also beginning to get their college acceptances. Avid students were on a field trip to UC Irvine last Thursday and they have a six flags trip to plan for. How's your life so far in UC Irvine? I absolutely love it. It's home. really great, yeah. So far, so good. It's a really inclusive place, so it's easy to make friends and like everyone, I feel like everyone that goes to college like wants to make friends, so it's just a lot easier to get to know people. The first month is really fun just because everyone is new and everyone's like trying to make friends. So this is the best time to meet new people and find new things. Okay, what's the what you guys major? I'm majoring in biology. And I'm a business administration. Nice. Okay. Have a nice day, guys. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Okay. Bye. The Education Academy continues to read the book Night as well as continuing to learn about puberty and adolescence. Speaking of the Education Academy, we have the top student in the Academy, Allison. We have been reading a book written by the Holocaust survivor, which is why we took a trip to the Holocaust Museum. Let's take a look. We have also been learning about the brain development in young children. If your future career consists of you being a counselor, a teacher, a therapist, or even a social worker, well this academy is for you. If you're a freshman or a sophomore and you're interested in joining, then you should definitely talk to your counselor about joining the upcoming school year. Or talk to Ms. Hazard in room 230. Bye Lions! Wow, I can see why she's the best. See you later! Good morning Lions! Athletics here with this week's news. Are you interested in any spring sports? What about golf, swim, or tennis? Let's get to know some of the coaches behind those spring sports. Hey, how are you guys doing out there in Eastside High School? This is Coach Mahan. I want to come to you about talking about playing golf at Eastside High School. Uh, right now it's boys season. We're going to start next week. Uh, I'm looking for two or three more kids to fill a team. Uh, you don't worry if you don't have golf clubs. If you can look over here, we have golf bags. We have golf carts so you don't have to carry them. We got plenty of golf clubs for you to borrow. We got golf balls. We got our jerseys. Only thing we don't have is you. So if you want to play golf and you've never played before, it's okay. We'll teach you everything. We have all the equipment. Just come by room 103 and see Mr. Mahan anytime during the day. Hey, go Lions. natural love for swimming? If so, come join our school swim team. Um, in order to join, you need good grades and have your athletic probation filled out. If you're interested in joining, please contact Ms. Blundman. Our first meet is March 3rd. Hope to see you there. Bye. Hello everyone, my name is Antonio Solis. I am the captain of the Eastside Boys Tennis Team and we're looking for a couple more boys to come out and try out for the team. We have practice every day after school, and I hope to see you guys there. If you are interested in participating in any of those sports, make sure to reach out to the coaches. But remember, Lions, don't forget to be cleared in order to participate in any sport. And head to the athletics office if you have any questions. Hey, athletes, quarter three is coming to an end. In three and a half weeks, we'll have the end of the quarter, and you must maintain a 2.0 GPA in order to be eligible. Let's work hard the last three and a half weeks, Go Lions. Congratulations to April Madrano for being this week's Athlete of the Week. Please come to room 118 to receive your free Jersey Mike sub. If I would be able to achieve anything, it would be to go D1. That's what I hope for and that's like the ultimate goal. What motivates you every day to keep playing sports? Um, what motivates me is like being better than I was yesterday. 
and getting those drops in my sweat bucket. What advice do you have for others in your okay, shoe? I would recommend for like people in my shoes to get like good time management skills, uh, get a planner and like manage like your schoolwork, the time you have to work out and the time you have to practice. Well, that's all for this week, Lines. Bye. Voting and elections are the heartbeats of our country's democracy. It gives us a voice that can be heard from our local neighborhood all the way to the White House. The success of any election relies on our community to work at a voting location to make sure all voices are heard. Vote centers in Los Angeles County vary in size from small to large. At the vote center, you'll perform various duties such as preparing the vote center for opening, greet voters as they arrive, look up voters on the e-poll book and issue ballots, and assist voters with the ballot marking device when needed. You will receive complete in-person and online training. For your service, you will receive a certificate of appreciation and of course, be paid for your time. That's it for this week's news. Now it's time to reveal the submissions for the Photoshop meme contest. Let's take a look. To vote on your favorite Photoshop picture, fill out the form in the description below. And remember, the winner will get a Dutch Bros gift card. Good luck to all of those who submitted, and we'll see you next week. Adios. Thank you. Oh, we forgot. We forgot. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no. Hold on. Wait. Wait. No, hold on. Wait. We were. I, I was supposed to say something to Miss Wallace. Yeah. I can't really remember what it was, so maybe we'll cover that next week. There you go. I just couldn't see the edge, but I'm good. I could read it. I just wanted to be a diva. Yeah. So you know that meme. Should I do this? <laughs> you gotcha. I know she. <laughs> hey, lads. I did that on purpose. <laughs> That's a sick beat. Come on. Hey. Right. Sorry, Kay's got lunch. All right, let's go. Here we go. Right. Who's the diva? <laughs> which, Is which, it recording? Which one? He is? All right, Wallace, quiet. Hey, Taryn, hey, quiet. Taryn, Taryn, quiet. Hey, Kiki.